we think you are smashing. <laughs> and we will do our very best for the Cayman Islands. Undoubtedly one of the best overseas territories. We can see how the government of Cayman is doing a tremendous job in making sure that we have an overseas territory of which has no concerns. We have 19 overseas territories, and many of them do have issues. Cayman does not. They are self-financing. They have good governance. Uh, they have a rule of law. So this proves that an overseas territory can work and is a model here in Cayman of how a British overseas territory should operate. Well, it's been a combination of a whole range of things, both economic, cultural and government related. Uh, we've learnt an awful lot about uh, the financial service in the industry and how you regulate it, and that's been very impressive. Uh, we've also uh, discussed with uh, government members the uh, relationship between the UK and the Cayman Islands, and it's quite clear that uh, uh, we want to establish a, a clear partnership of equals between them. Uh, you are a model democracy, well governed, and I think the relationship uh, certainly needs developing somewhat. Um, and you're very impressive, and that's the message I think we'll be passing on to our government. Well, the thing I really take away uh, from this latest visit to the Cayman Islands is just how well governed and what a good society that it is, a prospering uh, economy, uh, a real gem in the whole of the Caribbean region. But also what I take away is the fact that the Foreign and Commonwealth Office in London and the British government more generally needs to pay much higher respect to overseas territories like the Cayman Islands uh, and really see the islands uh, as part of the British family as equals and very much respect uh, what Cayman does so well. The highlight of my trip has been being here. I have never been to a place like this. This is Nirvana, frankly. Everything I've seen has been excellent. Government seems to work. The people have work and intermingle extremely well. Uh, the place has got a perfect climate. And to be honest, I think we've got one hell of a lot to learn from this British overseas territory.